to the airport it is 6 30. <laughs> hi guys ah, welcome back to my channel this is such a bad bad quality video because of the lighting don't have another lighting somewhere here um so you know i've been so traumatized by this airline Last time they left me behind at Hosea Kutako, like our international airport. So I woke up, guys, I I woke up at 10 to 6. Accidentally, somehow, somewhere, I woke up 10 to 6 and my flight departs at 7. You guys, I have never taken that type of shower. <laughs> no, I took like a full shower, but it was like... 15 minutes by 5 past 6 I woke up 10 to 15 minutes by 5 past 6 I was out of the shower in 5 minutes I was dressed I am dressed and it took me 10 to 15 minutes to get to the airport I literally just checked in now um, guys I just made it thank you Jesus you guys I could already see myself trying to find um buses to Ovamboland but anyways let me go sort out my relationship with my niece let me go board this flight and I hope this relationship is going to be me imagino tus labios pero en otra mujer por más que quiera la distancia no se acaba que haría si tus manos volvieran otra vez Si el amor que un día te tuve Fuera más grande que las nubes Fuera más grande que las nubes Otra vez Tú te vas Sabes que nuestra relación no va para ninguna I don't know where to touch There we go Hi everyone Welcome back to our channel My name is Wuven if you are new to the channel And if you are not family thank you very much for returning so i have a big smile on my face because i am in november land i'm home i'm back home what a blessing so i'm at the airport i just got into the car this morning was very interesting you guys i woke up very late but yeah i'm going to take you guys i'm i'm going home so i will take you guys along i know i'm gonna get up to but that is why i'm going home I'm going to plow because it's plowing season and when I left home it had not rained properly but now we have finally managed to plant and the crops have grown so I'm just going to um to work so the idea is that's what's going to happen I'll take you guys along I'm going to be home for quite some time so I hope you do enjoy the video so I am going to find my way out of the airport and morning guys um so i'm home i am i finally got home yesterday my voice is sleepy because the sun is not up yet and we have to wake up and go work the fields because it's clear skies today so we need to do as much work as possible we're going to plow in the field sorry so we're going to plow in the field and yeah this is the norm you usually have to get up before the sun comes up because it's cool it's not hot natalia can do any animals i'm just waking up my my cousins i see the boys are already awake so we're going to go now i'll just show you guys it looks like the sun is up but it's not up yet even the chickens are up 
So we're going to go in the field and go plow at Kaljima. Um, my battery is low, so I'll probably just vlog a bit, charge it, and then come back properly. Nanjil, Nanjila, my pen to go. Guys, the madness. Dude. So, I think our mango grew very fast because I don't understand how it's so big. Remember in January when I was complaining that there's no rain? I just need to open. Yeah. Well, it finally started raining and this is where we are. Oh my god guys look me look at this this jewel on all this is my home on all the mahango and I don't have a jersey <laughs> time to navigate oh my god look at this oh. but anyways I'm grateful oh my god that the mahango grew but look at this oh i have to walk past here meaning i have to go through <laughs> oh my god oh, you guys did? this is not it by the time i get to koshinenga i'm i'm soaking <laughs> this is not it okay my cousins are finally up. <laughs> Can you see? Ah, it's okay. It's okay. So they've already worked this part. Can you see? That part, that side, the mango is grown. Oh, we still have to clean. But this side, it's still growing. Okay, I am tired. I, I'm, I don't think, I know I'm not fit. So I'm going to, you guys saw the first part of the plowing. This is my cousin that's only coming now. So I'm going to charge my phone and then a bit later, because we're going to be here quite, maybe until around 12. Because the idea is just to finish today. Today we need to finish plowing and then maybe the rest of the, the field is just here and there so later on we are going to sing can you see my eyes yeah we're going to s don't worry i just woke up that's why the puffiness looks like this but a bit later i'm going to be glowing but yeah so later we are going to be singing someone is going to bring probably a shikundu i just take you guys through that process okay you guys i definitely played myself okay we are still in the field I definitely played myself uh, in the morning by not charging my phone because we did so much um, and I asked the kids to bring my phone now. Anyways, yeah, so we are busy. What happened here is um, we plowed earlier, but then the weed grew back faster than the mahangu. So what we're doing is this. So what's happening here also, um, when we planted some of the mahango um didn't grow properly so what's happening here is i need to take out some like that because else then it won't grow properly like that and do yeah that's why i'm saying you need to do this while it's still early because eventually the sun gets hot so what we do is we don't waste this one come here you can buy, you can go so long. Here, my cousin no can go. But do that now. 
So we gather this and then at on mic on mic is basically like this. So you have to take like maybe like this and then you do this and then where it didn't grow properly. Ideally you do this and like that and it just grows properly. Yeah. And then the small kids are going to Otakaranga. I just show you guys that. Yeah. Good job. You guys, what's happening here? Eh? It's a thin song. Don't go, boys. That cousin of mine. No, I won't. 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 This is a this song. No, Congo is that cousin of mine that is taking out the. So what the song is saying is, No, Congo, be still, keep, keep calm. With your beauty, you will be married. So the baby daddy is from Omakango. So we are like, we are going to go to Omakango. Don't worry. With your beauty, you'll be married. That's okay. Do I mind? So what happens here is when we work, we sing so that the load is um, easier. So, so this is what we did like today. Can you see all this we did today, the weeding. That's why we had to be up before the sun goes. Huh? Yeah, before the sun gets too high. So we're about to call it a day because the sand is starting to get warm. But I'll just show you what we did. That is the, it finally rained, yes. That is how it looks like. So, what we're trying to avoid is when the sand gets hot, then it will, it's not good for the mango. Well, this is maize meal. This is maize, not meal. And then we take some at a tweak. I'll just show you guys. I wish I had uh, my phone had charged earlier, but that's what's happening. So, this is how it looks like after people are done plowing. You see, these ones have dried from the sun all the way that side 
That is how it's supposed to look like. So, no dolonga, ah? Nanden fi apotea, no dolonga, nanden date kuange, no dolonga. This is actually a very nice song, but it's also one of those loosely translated. It's yo, you need to work this year because last year you didn't work. So, usually this song is aimed at the Vindukas that only come home once in a while. <laughs> I am not one of those vendors because you guys see me all the time. So we are resting a bit. We are just waiting for someone in the house to bring us Oshikundu. I'll show you what Oshikundu is. Yeah. And then some of us we are going to the coca shops after this to go drink a paka because it goes down like that. It goes down in the deer. Oh sorry. Because the paka goes down after. Like it quenches the thirst. But my other cousin is not encouraging us to go drink a puaka. He says we must wait for the oshkundi or we must go and buy sweet aid. Nobody's trying to. Yeah. Milk brew. Must not even have it. Osquindy. It's tradition. just queen the traditional brew. Yeah. Yeah. Malo ngengo itapa pinyo lumbo tato queen di. I'm so wrong for this. You guys, say I'm so wrong for this. I hope the kids don't go right for squinty their exam papers. But yeah, um, right now we are we are all drinking a spundo. I want this is a calabash, right? Um, grows here, or oh, is this pumpkin? But one of these things that look like this, we grow our calabash just in the field, and it's what we use to usually when we, there were no cups and mugs and jars jugs or jars this is what we use right uh, for water for drinking or squindy or squindy is, is definitely not a, a word but that is a traditional brew it's non-alcoholic it's very nutritious and we drink it for yeah every day we drink it and usually the kids also put in their little uh, containers when they take to school so this is like also seen as orus here but it's more nutritious it's more filling right and yeah we drink it when we are working and before this gets hard uh, it's um it's not butternut but it's one of those things where two months or a month from now I won't be here, but we will start um, eating the things that grew here. And part of this, the calabash, before it, it strengthens, before it becomes big, we are also able to eat it. I hope I can find a picture and just insert it to show you guys. But. Minto Bay. Next up, we are going to try. So these are our beans. They eventually they will spread out. So this is the bean area. I think I've showed it in one of my videos before. But we're going to see if there are some beans that we can take off and eat today. Then this is watermelon. Watermelon. Eventually it will grow. Din, 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 din. Yeah, this one's a grown. Can you see? So this is a big situation. No, Nandi. Like, let me show you. Apparently, over here. Oh yeah. Can you see? They started growing the worry melons. Where are And this is my mother directing the video. Okay, so can you see? This is how they spread out. And here they are preparing now to to pack on. Mala penali na lialos chanyeli. 
there's this one <laughs> okay i don't know how to translate that but there's this one that's already grown among all the other ones it's grown already i mean an adult man i can take some and go in your far and i'll just put it in my pocket as long as my mother doesn't i am going to show her because then i'm i'm encouraging other behavior and then this side is our maize meal you know maize wine okay so what we're going to do next can you see the mango is slowly starting to grow so what's happening now um our maize has started sprouting like the area and and usually that invites um thieves into your field so what we are going to do now is how do i say i'll just show you guys so that they can see that the maize has now grown when the people walk like on the sides like on the roads mama panda and so as soon as like they grow we have to to go and break off the heads that is direct translation but you get it so that the people don't climb over our fence to come and steal because they will come and steal so like so eh the the head nets they come in there like yeah <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay, Sam Oh, my mom just said apparently we also do this, so we take off this so that the mapungu, the maize can grow properly. Um, yeah, can you see? like this so like now can you see when you look you can't see anything so you think there's no maze but if these things are there then you obviously come and steal this is a pumpkin plants from mm -hmm. Like the, I know my, my, like I know a couple of people on my, like on, on YouTube, from the Katima Caprivisa, they say they eat the leaves. For us, we have a different use for the leaves, but this is pumpkin. This is how it grows. Mm -hmm. Like. So, this be our hose. These are the hose that we use. <laughs> Is there another word for this? Because this one sounds, yeah. So, this is what it used to be before, you know, and the men would go to the forest to go and get the sticks. But, there's a place. <laughs> you guys, this looks like a snake. <laughs> we now have this with metal. And in terms of it lasts better than so yeah. So we are done with the whatever. What 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 we are going to do now is we are going yeah. to replant. Yeah, we are going to replant this mango on the other side where it didn't grow properly. That's what we are going to do. You see, even So you can see. Can you see here? So this mango was done today. This whole area had not grown. It just looks like this now because of the sun. 
but like komatango like when it cools down and it rains this mango will grow properly so we're going to pick on this side Like that. Eh, tete malangwa na tangu. Na tangu. Na tangu. No, the reason why I was that just happened is because I said hey to me and I mean and adults you can't say that it's disrespectful in our culture. He's supposed to say mem. Ashke. So this is what's happening here. Hi guys, I took a nap, that's why I look. I am waking up to a monitor, Jimmy got to Jimmy. Oh, baby, be nabby. So, someone came to visit and brought a gift, the gift that you are hearing. This one. So, what's going to happen here now? It's a guinea fowl. Uh -huh. okay. I'm going to mark it with paint. Okay? So that everyone knows it's mine. I'm going to end the video here, guys. I hope you enjoyed the video. Okay?